Hi, now we're all worried about lead this summer. Is or isn't there lead in the water? Well, there are varying reports, but as a doctor in Hong Kong for many years, I've seen lead, mercury, even arsenic in people from central China. So in my books, heavy metal is something we should always screen for and be concerned about when we're living with all this pollution, this cadmium from motor vehicles, the mercury in the air, mercury maybe from dental amalgams. It's something we've got to worry about anyway. There's a theory that lead caused the demise of the Roman Empire. All their water pipes were of lead and they heated up their foods in lead vessels and, and even warmed the wine in vessels of lead. Also, lead was added to paint and some people feel that's why Van Gogh went mad because one of the the things about lead toxicity is it can cause um, memory loss, irritability and some mental instability. It's a neurotoxin. Also jumpy muscles, abdominal pains, general tiredness and fatigue. ADHD in children perhaps. So we can test for this really easily. Blood results come back in 24 hours, hair analysis, takes a little bit longer but it's still a good way to screen for heavy metals as of course it'll be excreted in the hair. If you are worried about you or your child having problems with heavy metals such as lead, don't hesitate to call and make an appointment.